Can mold toxicity be an issue when it comes to mental health? The answer would appear to be yes. While a single mycotoxin may not produce any effect, a combination of them can induce toxicity and at very low levels. These toxins can cause multi-systemic effects, including symptoms related to the GI tract, the heart, but also neuropsychiatric complications. Among xenobiotics, mycotoxins are worldwide contaminants of food that provoke toxicological effects, crucially resembling several symptoms associated with autism, such as oxidative stress, intestinal permeability and inflammation. A study in 2017 compared 52 autistic children with 58 controls. They measured levels of ochratoxin A in the urine and serum of the children and found significantly higher levels in the children with a diagnosis of autism. The authors comment that in vitro experiments were consistent in showing that ochratoxin A changes the regulation of certain genes related to autism. So this is an, an example of how an environmental factor, in this case a mold toxin or a mycotoxin, may produce symptoms consistent with a diagnosis of autism. And we know from the other videos that I've made that inflammation and oxidative stress and intestinal permeability can affect mental health in multiple different ways. So this may not relate simply just to autism.